third of startups are founded or run by female entrepreneurs. Despite recent progress, they are underrepresented and see slower business growth compared to their male counterparts. Small businesses and entrepreneurs are vital to prosperous cities. They generate jobs and create diverse communities. Removing barriers facing female founders will drive greater inclusive growth. The Alia Future Business Centre and the British Library Business and IP Centre are local organisations helping female founders start, run and grow their businesses. Women have the same business challenges as men. We want to help even more people and JP Morgan is enabling us to do that by taking our service, our people and our expertise out to the public libraries of 10 London boroughs. We create a programme of events a space, an environment and a network where women can feel really comfortable. Rowena takes part in the British Library programme and is the founder of the clothing boutique Revival Retro. I actually started using the Business and IP Centre back in 2009. The chance to talk to your peers, exchange stories of what's going on, what you're finding difficulties with, knowing that you're not alone. I think the Business and IP Centre offers so much more than some of our um, support organisations. There's so many resources here. In this kind of environment, I, I felt like I could grow. I felt like I had something where I could take my next step. I felt supported. Alia as an organisation is very geared towards diversity and inclusion and supporting underrepresented founders. We've essentially got four different innovation centres across the UK. The centre in East London based in Hackney is largely in partnership with JP Morgan and what we're trying to do here is I guess foster a very sort of entrepreneurial and, and startup ecosystem and, and make venture support accessible to the local community within East London. Megan joined Alia's incubator programme in early 2019 as the co-founder of retirement savings company Margie. Speaking as a, a sort of female founder, it's been really great to have kind of representative cohorts, so a significant proportion of the other entrepreneurs on the programme are women. Inclusion, I think, means having a space where everybody feels accepted and welcome no matter their differences.